All right, so I wanted to do a quick video about the car. I hit a deer with it uh, near Petternal's Falls. It had to be towed back. Um, I could drive to where I was going about five miles and 10 miles back to the park, so it's operational. You can turn the car on. Uh, but of course, uh, the headlights are gone here. Uh, you know, a lot of it is gone. You can open this door, for example, pretty easily. You know, there's a little thump there. I don't care about that. I want to get this car functional, if possible. It doesn't have to look pretty. For example, uh, it's completely gone. I don't know where it fell off, but there are the, uh, I think, under lights here. Those have not been working for years anyways because it got hit by a rock. I don't need that back on it, right? I just need it functional, road safe or whatever, and that's it. Uh, most of the damage was here. There's some damage there as well but with a spattering here. But uh, the only, um, this is actually the only light that works. The, um, you can see a bit of uh, some shards in there. The um, fog lights don't work on this. Uh, over here you have the water for the windshield wipers. The windshield wipers swipe and they probably, um, uh, water would be coming into them, but it, this got cracked. Uh, we'll open the, the, the uh, trunk for, or whatever this is, uh, the hood. Uh, I don't think the coolant thing is, is damaged there. But the point is, uh, some good Samaritan, when I arrived at my uh, location, he was able to, uh, I was able to drive it even when it, it was kind of hitting the wheel a little bit, but somebody pulled it up a little bit for me. Um, so it's, it, I could drive 15 miles on this, but again, I had to tow it back. Uh, so yeah, I mean, this is the, the major damage here. The lights are all missing. The... The battery doesn't seem completely dead. Probably it's a few years old anyways. Um, well, let's open the uh, trunk real quick. Here we go. So, so the battery works. It looks like it has a little crack in there. Uh, it's a couple years old anyways. Whatever this is, um, this fell off of it, but this is some electrical thing. It doesn't look like it's damaged, except this thing fell off of it. This cracked off of it. Uh, this is whatever this is. I think it's uh, the radiator. I want to say I don't know. So there's some tube going up there um, There's something leaking in there You can see little deer hairs, right? But again, it doesn't look as bad as you would think after hitting at least a deer or two That's the coolant thing that didn't break the washer thing did um, So anyways just to recap you know, if possible, this is not going to go through insurance. Uh, they probably would total this because, but I want it, I don't want it to look pretty. I want it to be, you know, road functional, road, um, what do you call it? Like it's legal to, road legal. So headlights, this thing would need to be bent back a little bit. This is the, right, this got bent. Uh, if some, whatever's leaking, um, most of the leak is gone. So I don't know if it's, it's whatever it is get the headlights on again no need for like the under lights or anything fancy um even with this thing i you know it's just i, I want to know what the um you know what options i have i think the ac doesn't work maybe that's leaking who knows but it doesn't have to be perfect like this this door it opens and closes but there's a little thump there i don't care it, it opens fully, it's, it, whatever parts may, may have hit it, dented it, but it, it's functional, I don't care. On the other side of the car, the passenger, or the driver's side, because of a small little thing here, maybe you can get a new one for this, or you can get, I don't know. Uh, but the point is, this is a little crumpled, so it's kind of, this is as far as it comes, right? So anyways, I'm just looking for, you know, is it possible just to do a relatively, whatever bare repairs are, are necessary to make this functional uh, and safe and road uh, legal or whatever. That's just what I'm looking for, right? So that's it. And uh, if you have any questions, let me know.